Vengi, it looks like you've got four nice runners on Sunday at Turfontaine. Let's start off with Lady Shatley. Um, she's obviously still a maiden, but um, I see that she opened at four to one and she ran a very decent sort of race, maybe better over a mile. Yeah, I think his first run when we had to fall, it was 1200. So we just uh, thought he needed more distance. That's why we just put him on 1600. We see how it comes from there. Okay, then what about Pied Kingfisher? Um, I know that there's some confidence in the stable that this one can run. Looks like he's just about ready to deliver a good performance. Yeah, Pied Kingfisher, we think uh, we got a small chance because we've got some blinkers on. So we see how he's going to do with the blinkers, uh, Simanga on top. Obviously, blinkers at the track and blinkers at the race course are different things because sometimes they relax at home, sometimes they pull on the way to the start. What has he been showing back home? Uh, when we put the blinkers, it worked well. Uh, everyone was confident and we were happy about the blinkers. So we see how he takes at the racing. Homeward bound now and race down to the 600 and Archimedes, a narrow leader with Master of Defence in second. Third is All Black Captain, We Are the Logans within three lengths of the leader. Uncle Lucky further back in the field down the inside is Pied Kingfisher trying to progress. Further back in the field came She's a Clava. 300 to go and We Are the Logans about to strike the front and comes forward with a strong uh, hesitation there but comes through to lead it now and We Are the Logans goes two to three lengths clear from Archimedes back behind that comes Pied Kingfisher but We Are The Logans goes on strongly for Leslie Logan and family and We Are The Logans has hit one by three lengths. Fantastic then Mambo Comtesio he won a good race last time out he's beaten some decent horses Buana Bridge from that same form line has come out and won which is very much in his favour. Yeah Mambo Comtesio uh, he's got I think 50 kgs on top uh, the other thing that Matsunyan is not the one who is riding it because of the weight. So we have just put to Clink. So we don't know how Clink is going to take it. But the horse is working well. Yeah, look, I think Nathan, Nathan Clink might have had a winner yesterday. So he's at least got a bit of confidence. Yeah, we hope so. Fantastic. And then the last one on the day is for the International Racing Syndicate. He ran behind Mambo Cantesio last time out. What are you expecting in the eighth? Uh, climate control is a good, nice horse, so we'll see how it's going to take, uh, I think it's 1600 meters, um, and it's a bottom weight also, but it's against a strong field.